Here's problem 12, 4. An 800 Newton billboard worker stands on a 4 meter scaffold supported by vertical ropes at each end. If the scaffold weighs 500 Newtons and the worker stands 1 meter from one end, where's the tension in the rope nearest the worker? Let's see what we have here. We've got our scaffolding. It's 4 meters long and in the middle is where we think its weight is acting. The scaffolding itself weighs 500 Newtons. We'll have a tension at one end, let's call it tension one, if I can write it here. And we have a tension at the other end, tension two. And there's a worker standing near one end, one meter from one end, and the weight of the worker is 800 newtons. So it looks something like this. Um, we can think of a point A at this end and a point B at this end. And we're asked to find the tension in the rope nearest the worker. So we actually want to find T1 in this case. Since I want to find T1, and I don't know T1 or T2, maybe what I want to do is select point B from my axis of rotation, and then I eliminate T2 from consideration as far as torques go, because its line of action goes, goes right through point B. So now... With that under consideration, we can think of a torque diagram that looks something like this. I got tension one with a moment arm of four meters, and I've got this 500 newtons with a moment arm of two meters, and I have this 800 newtons with a moment arm of three meters. The 500 newtons and the 800 newtons forces are trying to make this thing rotate about point B with a positive torque. So these are both trying to make this thing rotate counterclockwise with a positive torque, while the um, tension force is trying to make this rotate clockwise, which according to the right hand rule would be a negative torque. Uh, if I use my right hand rule, curl my fingers in that direction, my thumb will point into the page in a negative Z direction. So these torques should balance out such that the net torque is zero. We have the summation of all the torques about B is equal to zero. And we have two positive torques. We have um, moment arm two times 500 newtons plus moment arm three times 800 newtons for our two positive torques and then we have a negative torque minus moment arm four times tension one and tension one is what we want to find so we have four times tension one is equal to a thousand plus twenty four hundred or tension one is equal to thirty four hundred divided by four which would be eight hundred and fifty newtons so the force in the or the tension in the cord nearest the worker is 850 newtons. Answer.